Both tablets have a durable metal constructions, with microSAD card slots expandable up to 1 terabyte. Thankfully both quad speakers on either tablet sounds amazing and loud, even better Dolby Atmos is available. The availability of the fingerprint sensor integrated on the power button of the P12 separates it from its rival. Even better the inclusion of the Lenovo Tab Pen 2 Plus stylus makes it an even more desirable tablet. The A9 Plus does have a headphone jack which the P12 lacks, but I am inclined to give this round to the P12 since we do get a stylus, the wall adapter and a better base configuration with 128GB of storage compared to 64GB of the A9 Plus. Not to mention an extra tip for the stylus. If you find interest in either one of this device's links in description with latest pricing. Tab P12 has an 12.7-inch IPS LCD display with a resolution of 2944 by 1840 pixels. This display is bright, clear, and perfect for watching movies, TV shows, and playing games. Although the IPS display of the Lenovo tablet is only 60Hz, which may disappoint some users, but thankfully its rival does have 90Hz refresh rate available, but it has a slightly smaller 11-inch TFT LCD display with a 1920 by 1200 pixels. This display is amazing for streaming full HD videos on Netflix since it is Widevine L1 certified same with the Lenovo Tab P12, although it can only reach 1080p resolution for YouTube. While the P12 can easily surpass that to reach 4K resolution. To make matters worse the Tab A9 Plus display does not have stylus support which the P12 display has. In my opinion on which has the better display will depend on you. Mainly whether the higher 90HZ refresh rate is more important to you or a bigger display with stylus support. Hence this round is a draw. Both tab tablets have an 8 megapixel rear camera, but the P12 has a flashlight on the back and a better 13 megapixel front facing camera, compared to the 5 megapixel front camera of the A9 Plus. While both Samsung cameras max out at 1080p resolution for video recording, just like the rear camera of the P12. The front-facing camera of the Tab P12 can reach 4K at 30 frames per second, making it the better choice for taking video calls. And it wins this round. Both, both tablets run Android 13. The A9 Plus does have one UI 5.1 on top and Lenovo early customized the UI. Both tablets will receive Android 14 soon but for Lenovo that will be it. While Lenovo did add a PC mode feature which is similar to Samsung DeX, the A9 Plus has Samsung DeX mode available. This is very useful, especially when utilizing the Pogo pin connectors with an external keyword for increased productivity. On which tablet has the better software L will let you decide since this does come down to personal preference. Although L did find this post online stating the A9 Plus will receive two major version updates and four years of security updates, although Lenovo will have about three years of security patches left, L will still give this round to the A9 Plus. We have the Qualcomm Snapdragon 695 processor, paired with 4GB or 8GB of RAM, versus the MediaTek Dimensity 7050 processor, with either 4, 6 or 8 gigabytes of ram looking at geekbench tests the p12 has a slightly better single core a very noticeably better multi cores and gpu score even though both tablets have almost similar scores and this differences will not have major impacts on day-to-day -day activities of course of may have little bit better frame rates and graphics for the p12 when playing games but l will still have to give this round to lenovo for the better overall performance although the a9 plus performance is not horrible the Novo Tab P12 packs a 10,200 mAh battery with up to 30 watt fast charging. While the battery life is decent, lasting around 7 hours, with moderate usage, the A9 Plus has a 7,040 mAh battery, which easily lasts for 8 hours. On the topic of battery life the A9 Plus will last an hour or two longer than the P12. Unfortunately just like the P12 it has a slower charging speed of 15 watts, which will refill the A9 Plus faster than P12. Hence the A9 Plus wins this round. I'm In my opinion if you want a tablet with a large display, reliable performance and with the stylus included, purchase the Lenovo Tab P12. 
it is one of the best affordable 12-inch tablets out there, taking nothing away from the A9 Plus. With its better software updates and longer battery life it will be suitable for consumers whom don't care about stylus support and want a tablet that will be usable for a long time. Both tablets are implacable choices for watching movies and TV shows, and you cannot go wrong with either one. If interested in either one of this tablet's links in description with latest pricing. Thanks for watching.